he has going. So do not use use router. This one here, it's from next router. It is such a bad hook. I'll show you why. So you see, I created a two two states. One is current URL and then test URL. So current URL is simply going to use jQuery. You see, so we're going to use use effect jQuery when document is ready. Set current URL to page URL. So we are querying the current URL, right? And we are setting the state to the current URL. Now, this works exactly as you expected, right? After DOM loads, use effect fires, jQuery queries the URL and sets the state, um, DOM re-renders, voila, it works, right? With this thing, use router, I don't know why, but it's undefined so many times, it's insane. I even gonna console log it for you, you'll see it, okay? So now let's go to the page and I'll show you. It's absolutely insane how bad it is. Look. So we're going to re-render the page. Look, you see? Single project detail, right? So this is... Actually, I'm going to call it something else so you can see it. Um, we're going to call it use router URL data. Okay? So this way it's much easier to see it. Like this is disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. Look. Look. Undefined. Undefined. Page URL has already, so this is jQuery, has already changed to what it's supposed to be, right? And the other one, use router, is still undefined, right? Now jQuery fires again, right? And this thing is still undefined. Do you know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's still undefined. jQuery... F um, yeah, so... Only now, only now, at this stage, the use router kicked in. Right? And the state is still undefined. So do you see how bad it is? Uh, we need to separate jQuery from... So you can see the jQuery one. So this will be jQuery URL. And this will be... Whoops, we don't need this in here. So this will be jQuery. State change, right? State URL. And this will be use, I think it's use router state URL, okay? So we want to see which one will change the state to correct URL faster. And you will see that it's just, it's, it's not even close, right? So look, bam, right? So use router is undefined, undefined, defined. jQuery state has already kicked in, right? And this thing is still undefined. You see it's undefined. jQuery has already kicked in. And this use router state has actually never changed. Do you know what I'm saying? It's so bad it couldn't even set the state to correct URL, right? So I'm just telling you, do not use it. Under no circumstances, do not use this hook, right? What you do instead is you simply use jQuery, right? Because jQuery is very efficient, I find. Like, I like jQuery in combination with React. It's so, so efficient, all right? Take, and the logic makes sense, right? The logic makes sense. I don't like, honestly, I'm not a big fan of those kind of like React except for use state and use effect, right? In React framework, right? Because a lot of them start to render, re-render, gazillion times render, reload. 
they start to do all this weird shit. Whereas use state is very simple to understand, use effect simple to understand, jQuery simple to understand. In combination, your logic usually works really well. Okay, take care.